So, Drake. First of all, first of all, I just want to say this, okay? I always wanted my dream, my dream, when I came here in Canada and then I was introduced to rap music. Like, I've seen Jay-Z and uh, Kanye. Mm -hmm. We've seen Drake and 21 Savage. We've seen Drake and J. Cole. But the thing that I wanted when I was a kid, when I, when I, when I was in high school, when uh, I started listening to rap for the first time and I fell in love with it, I always wanted a K-Dot and J. Cole collaboration album. That is one of my biggest oh, dreams dude, that when I was young. Would, that would go hard, man. But now it seems like that is almost impossible after, well, well, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, after this issue. So, first of all, a shout out to Kendrick for coming for still being alive. So good news, he's still alive. He's still in the rap game. Thank <laughs> God, because I haven't heard him in a while since his last album. But ladies and gentlemen, he just dissed one of my favorite rappers of all time. Not Drake. Crazy Drake, OVO. It, it used to be Drake, but my favorite rapper of all time right now is Jermaine Lamar Cole. Jermaine Cole. When I was uh, when I was in high school, I did not know this guy until TJ introduced me to Jermaine Cole's first album. I believe it was um 2014 Forest Sales Drive. I'm not sure if that's the no, album. Side, uh, sidelines. Sideline story. Yeah, sideline yeah. story. Sideline that's story. the first time I've listened to Jermaine Lamar Cole, and ever since then, I've fell in love with J yeah. Cole. Since then, like I never, like I never, never once I ever dissed J Cole <laughs> for being a terrible rapper. Never. I don't think yeah, I never he's an dissed. Amazing him. Rapper. He's an amazing rapper. But unfortunately, Artist. ladies and gentlemen, somehow, some way, one of also the best rappers of this generation as well decided <clears throat> to diss my boy Jermaine Lamar Cole. I'm going to be honest. I'm not happy, but I do understand what he's trying to do here. And that's what it's called competition. Guys, K-Dot just one release with a collaborative album. With I love Future it. And Metro Boomin. First, I want to say, I love it. She, what dude, do you think of that song? Yo, yo, yo. The song was fantastic. The whole album completely fire man to me to me right now that's the best hip-hop album of the year at the moment unless somebody else drops something else that's better mm -hmm. right now that album is just so so good and yo rap beef rap beef is great for rap it is oh, great it is for rap. it is it is you know what i mean but, but not but not, not my boy jermaine no Cole no no this, this is great man. man you know you know you know when the great when the top when the top is at war with each other man it's it's incredible. And dude, all I'm gonna say is like Drake has pissed off a lot of people. Drake has had more beefs with anybody. Well, I mean, well, sorry, Drake has had more beefs with everybody pretty much in the industry at this point, bro. Because how the hell you get future to turn against you? That's how true. you get Metro Booming to turn against you? That's true. Hey, and I know why. All, it was because of a girl, apparently. First of all, I just want to give a big shout out to Metro Boomin, one of the best producers out there, like making one of the best yeah. beats and productions of all time. But wait, 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 wait. But how do you get Kendrick Lamar against you? That, exactly. But, but, but let's be real, man. Kendrick will do this type of stuff without having any beef with you. Because remember on that Big Sean Control, uh, mm -hmm. Big Sean song, uh, it was called Control. Mm -hmm. He dissed so many people like saying oh jermaine cole on on my level drake on on my level he said he name dropped all of them and he oh he he was just amazing on that song he said none of you are on my level jake i mean he has done that before i so disagree just because this is happening I, I don't really think that kendrick lamar has a beef with drake this is something that he's done before if you guys haven't checked it out uh go check out the song big sean control a great track. Great track. Uh, yeah, he, he's done this before, so I don't think he has a beef. But apparently, uh, Future and him do, though. So, for, so let's let's look at the lyrics here. So, um, K-Dot K was in the uh, one of the songs. Uh, was it called We Don't Trust You in the social uh, album? What's the name of the song? Like yeah. that. Like that. So, uh, Lamar throws several shots at Drake. And J. Cole, um, they were talking about, he was dissing about the, the album First Person Shooter, the song, and the uh, and the album of Drake. So, you know, he said, he said in the lyric, yeah, get up with me, 
F sneak dissing first person shooter. I hope they came with three switches. So that's what he said. One of there, and then uh, that was a aggressive Lam- uh, spew response from one of uh, Cole's um, lyrics when he said, "Love when they argue against the hardest MC. Oh, is it K dot? Is it Aubrey or me? We the big three, like we started the league." And then um, Lamar decided to respond to that specific lyric, and he said. Think I won't drop the location. I still got PTSD. Mm. Motherfuck the big three. N-word, it's just big me. Hey, yo, that's a bar, bro. Hey, I like, I love that mentality in rap, bro. I love that mentality. Rap has been too soft lately, okay? I I need people coming out and claiming that they are the best, okay? We need better competition because rap has been trash lately. I'm sorry. Rap has been absolutely trash lately. Like with albums, songs, and everything, it has been trash. This this right here is good for the game. Competition is good for the game. This mentality is good for rap. Okay, I, I, I'm fine with that. I'm supportive with the, the with the um, with the uh, what's it called Co- competition. But the thing is, I still want them to collab. <laughs> <laughs> the problem, because bro, these are the two greatest rappers that I oh, have dude. right now. K dot and I, I, I definitely, I definitely think J Cole and Kendrick have no problem with each other, man. Yeah, this, I, this, this is something. This is not the first time uh, Kendrick has name dropped or or done this before. Like he, he, they're all cool. Like like Kendrick, Kendrick and Cole are cool about it. Like trust me, and Drake, Drake and Kendrick are cool about it. The true people that actually have a beef in this whole thing. Our future, future and, Drake. Uh, and oh, yeah. Drake. So let me let me share my screen really quickly, okay. right? So this is the girl that supposedly broke. Uh, <laughs> this is supposedly the girl that uh, Future Yo. and Drake are beefing about. You see the comments right here. This girl said, "You look like something Drake would cry over." Like, just look at this girl's comment section, bro. Can, can I just say something off the, uh, off, th- like, can I just say something here? Say what you got, say what you got, say. Dude, she low-key looks like my best friend, bro. And you know who I'm talking about. Oh my about. gosh, she does look yeah. like her. Yeah, yeah, yo, yeah. Oh <laughs> I see her too. Yo, yo, yo. Oh my Anyways, God. Yeah, 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 yeah. Anyway, go ahead. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. This I I would show other pictures, but there's a there's some very provocative pictures over here that would get us banned on YouTube. That <laughs> voila, unfortunately I can't show. Uh, you know what? Let me go right here and then let me show a different picture. <laughs> let me just pick carefully, <laughs> so we don't get in trouble. <laughs> bro, goodness. Yeah, but yeah, this bro. this is the girl that they've been uh, beefing about, man. Uh, man, it's it's crazy. There's even a whole entire song on the album called Prince Diana, right? And damn, I can't even. Oh, frick, I can't even really show the whole thing, dude. No, 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 let, no, let, just leave links on the just to show them. But like, don't Actually, show it because like, we'll get in trouble. And then I'm gonna cover it. Okay. I'm gonna cover it. Okay. Right. So if you see up here, if you see the cursor, Princess Diana. And then there's a song on the album called Princess Diana. And this girl apparently had a thing with uh, Drake and Future, which caused a fallout. And obviously, Drake Drake has a huge, huge uh, history of actually doing this to his friends as well, too, dude, right? He has a huge, huge history of doing this to his friends where he goes and has a thing with his friends' ex thing or girlfriends, if you didn't know. Yes, John. Yeah, I, I know you like him when you see, bro. No, I'm, no, it's not like what I'm, what I'm seeing. I'm just shocked that she looks like her, man. I'm sorry. Like, I'm just like, like, uh, like I can't unsee it anymore. After thinking yeah, that, I'm bro. like, shit. Okay, but anyway. Okay, first of all, um, Drake, this guy is a certified lover boy. Like, we already know that. Like, But, like, here's the thing. Yo, these guys got to stop, like, finding women like these because, like, these women, these women, man, like their their standards are so high. It's crazy, bro. Man, it, it's insane, bro. You know what's the worst part about this girl, man? Mm. She has a man. Oh my god. She has oh a man. Let, oh me, let, me, god. let me, let me, let me. Oh man, it, it's just it's just wild, bro. I can't show the photo, but you can see it on the beginning right here at the bottom. Can you? Uh where? Where? Oh, never mind. You can't see it. Damn. I can't but see it. uh oh, that's shit it. man but yeah it's uh it's crazy she has a man as well too so it's it's kind of it's kind of wild 
it's extremely wild. It's extremely wild what's going on out here, man. It's uh, yo, for okay, like here's the thing. Wait, wait, but, but back to the uh, back to the um, rap album uh, yeah. song here. Um, Jermaine Cole and uh, like Jermaine Cole. Uh, here, here's my here's my prediction. I hope, I hope on the Fall Off album he's he adds another song to it. I would love to have him have add a song to it. If he if if K Dot's gonna diss J Cole for uh for being in Drake's song, I would love for J Cole to go back cycle back to his studio, add another song to his Fall Off album. I would love to see that. I would love it. I would love, I would to love to the that. beef to go between back and forth, man. Like good for like, rap, good for rap. And again, guys. Jermaine Cole is one of my favorite rappers. Like again, like I said, I've, I've said it's, I've see, I've said it to my friends a couple of times. Like Jermaine Cole is in my top five, top three actually, top three. Like of like, all time, top three of top three right now, top three right now. Top okay, three right now. all time. And we'll be different. doing a, a all time video later on, guys. Later so on, but tune in for that. but Jermaine Cole, man, I don't think I've ever had one bad song about his his albums. I've never I had agree. one. Cause like talented. Jermaine Cole is so consistent, and he's so talented. Like he knows what's up. He knows he's doing. And and the thing about the thing that's a plus for me, bro, about this guy, he, he's freaking humble and legendary. And mm. I just hope one day, one day that that he's listening to this song from K Dot, that Jermaine Cole, this is him, at the fall off. Because I would love to see it. Because this is uh, apparently this is his final album. I hope it's not. I still want more J Cole. But shout out to J Cole, man. J Cole. I still hope for a K Dot a collaboration album. I still want that to happen. That is one of my biggest dreams when I was in yeah. high school. I want that shit to happen. Make it happen after this this uh, beef that that you have right now. And also to Drake, Drake, you um you've fallen off low key sometimes. Sometimes oh, you're off and off. <laughs> Drake, Drake, Drake to me has fallen off like Yo, heavily. Bro. I really miss the 2011 heavily. Drake. I miss heavily. 2011 Drake. I need that so, shit back. So 20, 2010, 2010 to to 2014 17 Drake? 17 okay Amazing. i need first of all i really need that drake back for if you're gonna if you're gonna get this by k, k dot i would love you drake to bring back your freaking old self from the 2011 Not happening, like bro. like bro when you dissed uh when you dissed meek mill from back to back that shit was fire i that love back fire. to back back to back was fire. i need that type of song man if you're gonna diss back please i want that shit Make yourself great again, man. That's what Skidot's doing. He wants the fucking competition to fire up. Bro, like, again, shout out to Future and Metro Boonin for being for making this song. Because, bro, right now, rap needs to go back on tour where it's been. Yeah. Uh, Jermaine Cole hopefully releases this track, or response at least. I hope he's in the studio right now working on that motherfucker. Also, to Drake, please. Bring back your old self. You need that and, shit right now. And and I will uh and I will say this, right? Uh just to end it off, Drake has had beef with so uh the weekend, so Pusha T, uh <clears throat> Kanye West, uh Meek, uh Jay-Z at some point, uh future now. <laughs> Over Metro now, now. Girl. it's crazy. I, I can keep going on. There's there's a lot of people that this. Oh, Meg the Stallion, but that's understandable. Yeah. Uh, sh- bro, you can keep going on. You can I keep going on. on. But mm-hmm. yeah, guys, you know that's the beef happening out here, man. It's kind of crazy, bro. It, th- this stuff is just kind of wild, and I love to see it right now. Hopefully, this drives better music into the rap game because, like I said, rap. Has been getting trash and trash and trash and trash. It really mm-hmm. has, in my opinion. Uh, but yeah, guys, thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Make sure to leave a like, comment, and share. Follow our links in the description. Peace.